Hello, Philippe. Hello, Philippine. So today in a world moving to an acceleration to a sustainable economy, we are moving away from the linear economy to a more circular economy in which raw materials, products need to be designed for multiple use. And we at Deso System believe that we can help tremendously in this acceleration. At Deso System, we combine art, science and technology with knowledge and know-how to address industry challenges. We have been doing that for more than 40 years. Uh, in the case of circular economy, our clients can get faster deploying our virtual twin experiences technology, as well as the 3D experience integrated platform as the collaborative environment for innovation. That's how we can move forward, Philippine, and with technology that can design out value leakage. And by value leakage, you mean the practice of discarding products and materials after use? Indeed, with the right technology, you're right, we can reduce or even stop the leakage. The technology I mentioned gives us the power to keep the value of products, services and materials through time and throughout the value chain. Exactly. And then we can focus on value creation and bring to life a truly circular economy. Exactly, with virtual twin experiences, anything can be created as models to represent the real world. Materials, products, services, factories, value networks, and even system of systems. In a virtual environment, we're able to explore and accomplish so much more. That's right, Philippe. And right now we know that there's a huge amount of materials and products that are currently going to waste materials that are very hard to extract once they are in products. And to offset this cost to the economy, we need to transform the way in which we approach materials and product design. Yes, indeed, at Dassault System, we see that, uh, Philippine, through our clients' eyes. And we have the right technology, knowledge, and know-how to support this transformation. Imagine uh, being able to quickly come up with new materials that are eco-friendly, uh, materials that are biodegradable and easy to recycle, or designing new breakthrough chemical processes that are far more efficient and less polluting. The renaissance of material science is happening now. And that's certainly very exciting because materials are a huge part of the equation. But we can also help on the product itself, right? Yes, uh, with the virtual twin experience and the collaborative platform, companies can experiment and then apply circular design principle to the product at every step. From the start, the imagination, to usage by clients, consumers, citizens, patients. This is a new area of product lifecycle management. Our clients they rely now on virtual prototypes instead of physical ones. We validate new circular concepts with speed and cost efficiency. Many more use cases can be virtually tested before the production starts. The results? Well, you cut down on waste and reduce the environmental impact of the product as it moves along the supply chain and the whole value network. Indeed, and this means a shift away from the linear supply chain to a circular value network. And this involves a whole new concept of circular business models. A model that allows us to close the loop in design, testing, manufacturing, logistics, assembly, reverse logistics and disassembly. All of it. Yes, and uh, our technology brings it all together. Uh, the Virtual Twin Experiences technology uh, harnesses the enterprise data uh, and elevates it with semantics to your knowledge and know-how, which makes it a highly powerful and precious asset in the company. The platform also provides you with a single source of truth. Uh, this allows everyone to work together to translate the information into insights and immediate decisions. Exactly. It provides you with actionable insights and helps the customer to identify new sources of value to prevent value leakage, enabling them to increase the efficiency and reduce the cost and the waste at the same time. Definitely, we understand the role that technology plays here. 
And when we work with industry leaders, I will name some of them, uh, we make sure to provide as an outcome meaningful results. This is how we're measured. One great example is uh, Amcor rigid packaging. Since 2006, Amcor has relied on our virtual twin experiences to engineer strong, protective plastic bottles. With less plastics, uh, this can account for 400 metric ton of resin savings a year. That's enormous. The virtual twins of new designs are subject to various conditions, various performances tests in the computer, proving and perfecting the performance without testing a single physical bottle. With that, it has helped Amcor to reduce the weight of its bottle by 35 to 50%. This in turn reduces the energy that Amcor requires to transport their containers and this is going on and on for the entire value network. This is a great example. And indeed, sustainable packaging is definitely one of the main challenge ahead. Absolutely. Uh, another example in the paperboard packaging sector. A producer has been able, using the virtual twins experiences, to improve the functionality, but also the recyclability of its customers' packaging solutions. They have been maximizing product performance while minimizing environmental footprint and cost. That's a good equation. So indeed, this is great. This means less energy to process the raw materials, but also for the manufactured products. So all in all, less environmental impact. Do you have other examples in other industries? Yes, we do. In the fashion segment and more precisely fashion manufacturing, we support AMF to ensure that all materials used are in line with a company's environmental and sustainability objectives and policy. With our technology, IMF can make the surface treatment as sustainable as possible. The outcome is that the company is able to produce fashion goods that are high quality and long lasting. Indeed, and we've also helped a major producer of cement and concrete to operate in a more sustainable way. Cementos Argus wanted to reduce their environmental impact, but not only, they also wanted to create a positive benefits of the people, for the people and the communities around them. Touching people and community, that's a great idea, a great concept. Uh, Dassault System mission is harmonize product, nature and life. So uh, Philippine, how did it turn out? Well, through the virtual experiences, they were able to optimize and influence the extraction and the planning processes. And as such, by partnering with us, Cementus Argos paved the way to show that sustainability and profitability could go hand in hand. Let's now move to a different sector, the life science and healthcare sector, and uh, with a biopharma company, uh, who had the ambition to develop more sustainable practices with the laboratory operations. And we helped make this happen. Uh, thanks to our solution, the company was able to reduce the raw material quantity in some key processes by a factor of six. Uh, they could integrate green chemistry, materials, repository within an electronic lab notebook, uh, allowing the scientists to select more environmental friendly chemical processes. Standards were developed to measure the greenness. Measuring is a key topic as well. Uh, and this was true for individual reaction to entire processes. These are very inspiring stories indeed, Philippe. And what I love about them is that they cover all the sectors in which Dassault System is active. And they give us a many reasons to believe. What we can say is that although circular economy is indeed a challenge, through the power of technology, we can make it a reality. Thank you so much, Philippe. Thank you, Philippine. We make it happen. Exactly. <laughs>